Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today's video is going to be method two with my Laceous Clavker Queen. Now instead of brood boosting, I'm adding this queen, which is unfortunately dying. She's not completely dead yet, but as of the day after this filming, she did die. So what I'm doing here is I'm going to add her in with her because I've also seen methods where you add an almost dying queen to do that instead because I really don't like digging up ant nests around my house because then it's harder for them to rebuild and sometimes then there won't be as many elites around. Anyways guys, let's do method two. So I'm placing the queen inside the tube with Lace Lacey's Clavker Queen. Just about in there. Perfect. Okay, so now she's in the test tube with her. I watched in suspense as I waited for to see what happened. At first the queen was just inspecting her, not really sure what to do. And then she didn't really pay much attention. So I waited and I waited, but then I noticed something that excited me because I was waiting for this. It appeared that the queen was on top of the other queen and I was pretty sure this is her trying to rub her own scent on top, or I mean onto her so that she would smell like her. And then I hoped after this, she would hopefully start laying some eggs. Anyways guys, I know this has been a quite a little short video, but don't worry, hopefully there'll be another video up either today or tomorrow. I'm trying to upload as much as I can, so I do hope you guys are enjoying these little videos. Um, and the next video should be how to do test tube setups and when queens fly. So stay tuned for that either today or tomorrow. Depends when I'm done editing it. Thank you guys so much. Also, I have to say this, on my ant keeper shout out video it has a hundred views so that's awesome thank you guys so much and again you're so close to 50 subscribers so please hit the subscribe button to help me out anyways guys it's at love forever